Hello everyone. A truly intelligent person is one who can pretend to be a fool in front of a fool who pretends to be intelligent. Today, let's read a story of such an intelligent man whose name was Gopal. Let's learn chapter 3, Gopal and the Hilsa Fish. Before moving to the story, let me explain who is Gopal. Gopal was a court jester in the medieval West Bengal. He was the court jester in the kingdom of Raja Krishna Chandra. Gopal used to give joy to others by laughter and ridicule. The king considered him as a Navaratna of his court. Gopal was a very intelligent person and was keen in his ideas. His stories are very much popular. His story, Kopal and the Hilsa Fish, is very funny. Let's see the lead characters in the story. They are Gopal, Kopal's wife, the king and courtiers. Courtiers mean the advisors of the king. Before you get into the real story, you must know Hilsa is a popular fish found in the rivers of India. It's mostly sold during monsoon season. In the story, the season is probably in the monsoon. The lesson is a comic visualization of a story of a king who challenged his witty courtier Gopal to bring Hilsa fish to the court. He successfully completed the challenge in the funniest way possible. The beginning of the story tells about the season in which Hilsa fish were available. Everyone was talking about it. The fisherman was the happiest as they could earn better with this immense treasure. The markets were flooded with the Hilsa fish. Everyone was surprised and happy with the availability of the fish. However, the king was annoyed at the discussion of the fish. He burst out when a courtier boasted about the size of a hilsa fish he caught. Later, the king realized his mistake for overreacting. He further added that even Kopal couldn't resist mentioning about hilsa fish. However, Gopal informed him that he could bring a huge hilsa without anyone discussing a word about it. After a few days, Gopal prepared himself with half-shaven face and smeared with it ash. He wore tattered clothes. Everybody noticed his appearance in rags and gave him names, a madman, a mystic, etc. When he reached the palace, he was stopped by the guards. His stupid behavior attracted the attention of the king who wanted to see the crazy visitor. No one could recognize Gopal. When his true personality was revealed, he told him that because of his appearance, nobody talked about the fish. They were taken aback and were repelled by his shabby clothes. Thus, he won the challenge. Children, did you enjoy the story? Now, let's listen to the conversation happening in India during the monsoon season, the time of Hilsa fish. Okay? Come, come. Buy, buy. The price of Hilsa is down today. Householders could talk of nothing but Hilsa fish. How much did you pay for that Hilsa? You wouldn't believe it if I told you. And in the palace too, the courtiers could discuss nothing but Hilsa fish. Your Majesty, you should have seen the huge Hilsa I caught. It was... Stop it! Are you a courtier or a fisherman? The courtier fell silent with downcast eyes. The king felt guilty. I am sorry. I lost my temper. It is the season for Hilsa fish and no one 
not even gobal can stop anyone from talking about hilsa fish not even for 5 minutes buy a huge hilsa and bring it to the palace without anyone asking you a word about it i accept the challenge your majesty a few days later in gobal's house his wife asked him why is your face half shaven i am dressing up to buy a hilsa fish what's the matter with you why are you smearing yourself with ash i told you i am dressing up to buy a hilsa fish listen to me please you can't possibly go out in these disgraceful rags what are you up to how many times must i tell you man i am out to buy a huge hilsa fish it's happened to him he is gone mad gopal bought the hilsa fish and started walking towards the palace mother look at that man isn't he comical he must be a mad man boy shh i think he is a mistake when gopal reached the court what do you want i want to see the king you can't see the king get away with you Gopal began to dance and sing loudly inside the palace caught the man is crazy throw him out at once i want to see the king let me in bring that man to me at once yes your majesty gopal was brought before the king It's Gobal. The man has lost his mind. I think it's one of his crazy jokes. All right, Gobal, out with it. Why are you dressed up in this ridiculous fashion? Your Majesty, you seem to have forgotten something. Forgotten something? Strangely enough, no one seems to be interested in hilsa fish today. from the market to the palace and in the court not a soul has spoken a word about hilsa fish only then did the king remember the challenge he had thrown to gopal <laughs> well gopal congratulations you have achieved the impossible once again hope all of you have enjoyed the story read the story and enjoy yourself thank you